Hello there. So today we are going to learn how do we do statistics on Casio FX 91 EX class with. This is the sixth video of the series and the sixth app of class with that is statistics. Okay, let me quickly go to the Casio emulator there and I'll show you. So let's go in and let's go to statistics that is number six. You can take quickly press number six as well right and let's do a small you can do all one variable statistical calculation here or regression calculations as well so i'll do one variable regression right one variable statistics i'll push number one and then here you have your list that you can take in so let's check the random temperature of uh, rct for last 10 days so i'll say 19 14 those are just random values that I'm taking. Twelve. Nineteen. If you're following the lesson with me, you can copy the same values or you can take other values as well. Right. So I have taken the temperature, let's say, for eight days only. And I would like to solve, calculate the statistical value. I'll hit option, OPTN and it gives you what do you want to do so i would like to calculate one variable calculations i'll push number three voila it gives all your values so mean x bar is mean that is 16.125 summation of x summation of x square standard deviation population deviation and if you scroll down you can see your number of observations that is eight minimum quartile one median quartile three etc similarly if you would like to Calculate along with frequency. You can push shift and go to setup, and there you can add your frequency as well in statistics. Push number three, frequency on off. I'll say number one. Now frequency is also on. So let's take this time. We would like to find out. Uh, you know, uh, uh, is in in the classroom. We would like to the data set says that uh, the average height of a student in a classroom so I'm just going to take some random values there okay and then I'll give the frequency as well so on the frequency side currently it is one 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 but if you would like to if you have the question and the question says something else you can take in the values all right, and now we would like to find out statistical values. So I'll hit option. I'll go to one variable calculation number three, and voila, I have the values now. So you can do that, and uh, hope you enjoy the video. Please like the video and subscribe for our future videos. Thank you very much. Have a good day.